Yeah, y'all. Here we go, Bunch Big Sale fans. We are live from the Zippo Living Room here at the Sound of Ice Amphitheater. It's Jason Davis and Hobart being joined by the folks from Paramore. Well, welcome to South Florida, guys and gal. Thank you. Thank you. This is beautiful. And uh, I would have to say that overwhelmingly, you guys have had the most positive response from the crowd so far. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you guys. And I've seen, I think, I've definitely seen more cameras right now in the crowd. <laughs> Everybody who has a camera yeah, right here, hold on. Take up. a picture right oh, now. Take a picture right now. Look at this. I, I look around, I see everybody's cameras. They're all just wow. snapping photos it's of It's like the red carpet. They're nuts. It's for very it. much like that. Yeah, we rolled out the red carpet for you guys. <laughs> Thanks. So, um, are you? How long have you guys been touring behind this album so far? Um, pretty much all year. The the album was released in oh my gosh, June twelfth, right? Oh my gosh, yes. Okay, I couldn't remember <laughs> it for a second. I had a brain fart, but um, so yeah, the, June twelfth. So the last six, seven months, something like that, you've been out on the road pretty steady for it. Oh yeah, well since since March really. And then as soon of course as uh, of course as soon as misery business started to hit around the country, I'm sure you guys booked a lot more dates in the future, and you guys will be locked up for quite a while, right? Pushing the record. Oh yeah, touring nonstop. That's all we like to do. You gotta. You gotta. So so the album came out in June, and just the other day, Thursday, I believe, you guys were given the gold record, 500,000 copies That's for right. the new album. Give it up. <laughs> Yeah. So the the question is, where do you hang the gold record plaque? In our bedroom above our heads. That's right. Yeah. So we can look up while we're sleeping and be like, ah. <laughs> dude. They got to work for that platinum marker. <laughs> yeah, dude. I've you, talked to a lot of folks. They put they like to put them in their bathroom for some reason. I don't really? know. Really? Yeah. I don't I don't want to look at my face while I'm taking a dump. You know? Yeah. <laughs> That's one of the things thing to consider. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I, I guess they get in a moment of contemplation and they start looking up and then they start thinking. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe, it, maybe it sparks brainstorming yeah. on future plans. Like, right, you know, we right. could do the next record. You really can get a lot done sitting on the toilet. It's true. true. <laughs> in more ways than one. <laughs> so you guys are going to be going out on tour oh, with Newfound Glory next, huh? Yeah. Woo! Yeah, you guys will be wrapping up our uh, our second stage, the the G Star School of the Arts stage over there. So five twenty. 520, everybody needs to be over to the side stage. Yeah, we'll see you guys there. Now, um, I know I, I'm not going to ask the obvious question. I'm just going to bring up the fact that everybody else asks you about the fact that you guys are not really, like, 40 years old or anything. You're kind of <laughs> yeah. younger. So, um, no, we're 40. How tired are you of everybody saying, gosh, you guys are so young? <laughs> We we're, we're used to it. It's yeah. cool. We yeah. like being young. We don't want to be old, so it's a good thing. Oh, <laughs> exactly. Well, I can't wait to get 70. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, what a blast that's going to be. Yeah. No, we love it. It's it's cool. But I mean, but even though, um, you know, you, you guys uh, have been a band for a, a few years, you guys, uh, some of you have known each other for much longer, right? right? I mean, yeah, kind of grew up or, or, or met each other in school or something like that. Yeah, we met. Uh, I met Zach when he was 11, and I think I was like I had just turned 13. So it's it's been a while. We kind of I feel like we've grown up together, even though we met only six six or seven years ago. Only six or seven years ago. Yeah, That's a good yeah. long time. Though. Yeah, it's, it is. It, you're right. And uh, the 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 album that was not your first uh, recording. You guys had some what EPs and things out before that. We had a ton of demos, just a ton of demos. We worked with, uh, with two dudes in Nashville for a while that had a studio in their homes, and um, I don't know, we, we got, we actually recorded more than we played local shows, so it, we, we love That's being rare. in the studio. Yeah, I know, right? Most people do nothing but play local shows, right. and then they're like, all right, let's scrape up our budget and record these six songs, and then that's it. They don't record anything for like two more years. Yeah, I think that's the difference between Nashville and like a lot of other cities, though. It's just everyone's into music, and everyone's got a studio in their house, and everyone's you know, recording all the time. So There's studios all over Nashville, yeah, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. You get any uh, country musicians on your uh, on your <laughs> session? Like any background keyboard players or steel steel guitar coming in or anything? No, but you know what? We met Ricky Skaggs. He's like famous bluegrass, just insane. And yeah, familiar with him. One day we'll work with him. 
if that's something you aspire to do, <laughs> I don't know. I'm not gonna trash country music. No, but that, right. you guys must be. Are you, are, is that where you're, you are all from? Is the Nashville area, or did you just, it's just ended up based there? We uh, well, we all sort of came from different. Yeah, she lived in Mississippi. Right. Yeah, he we was born, born in Mississippi. Different places, yeah. uh, we were born in New Jersey. He's born in North Little Rock. Little Rock. North Little Rock, Arkansas. Little Rock, Arkansas. Yeah. But we all ended up in Franklin, which is like 20 minutes south of Nashville. So, it's a magical nice. place, Franklin. What else is there besides recording studios and Trolls quick access? Trolls and fairies. It's magic. Is it far from uh, Rock City? Um, you know what? I went there with my family. It's probably like two hours from there. Uh, uh, that's <laughs> like so far. You that's cool. That's just... <laughs> They're passing the mic over here. My man's He's laughing. Talk. He's like, every time, every wow, what a conversation. <laughs> every time I got to talk, Josh would be like... <laughs> now you boys share the microphone. That's why there's a swivel on it. You can talk and then you can talk. If you mind. All right, you guys are going to tear up the second stage here in just a bit. And before uh, that happens, they are going to go. I think there's a few people here that might want to meet you and get your autograph. I, is, is that it? You guys want to meet Paramore? No. Is that, you guys? Okay. So you would want to get their autograph and make them back. <laughs> well, we want to give it to you, so... Okay, cool. Well, I gotta say, that. I got to say congratulations, you guys, on your uh, gold album. That's very cool. Thank Six you. months, and uh, the I new know. album's already... It's a hell of a, a curve there, the, lear yeah. the learning curve or the, or the arc or whatever. It's like... And you guys got plenty of years to stay as a band and, uh, yeah. and get many platinum records. So we're looking forward <laughs> to seeing you guys at 520 today, Thank closing you. down the side stage. Yeah. For Bo's Bake Sale 2007, give it up for Paramore. Yeah. Thank you! Hey, we, we just played some Paramore, but why not play some more? We'll play the uh, the newest single. It's Crush, 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 Paramore by Space Sale 2007.